Hello, it's Richard here from Rivers Music in Edinburgh. I've driven into work today um, and enjoyed what can only be described as a typical um, mid-August Scottish day. Uh, so I, I, I set off from home in, in glorious sunshine. I've been through um, torrential rain, fog, high winds, um, fire, earthquake, pestilence, frogs, toads, locusts, the lot. And I'm just looking out the window here in Edinburgh and it's glorious sunshine again. So uh, welcome to Scotland. <laughs> Got something really special for you today. It's often the case in these videos that we talk with you about the high-end instruments um, but today I'd like to talk with you about uh, an entry-level instrument uh, and that is the Yamaha B1 acoustic piano. The B1's been around for a few years but it's been really really popular and, and rightly so. Players love Yamaha, teachers love Yamaha, this is a proper little Yamaha compact piano. It's only 109 centimetres in height, which means it's a sensible size for a modern house, but it still has that brilliant Yamaha tonal quality that you'd expect. It still has that brilliant Yamaha build quality that you would expect also. The B-series pianos are built in our factory in Jakarta. Um, so, although it's not built in Japan, don't let that be an indication that you think, mm, well, it's, it's not quite as good as the Japanese products, or it's maybe not quite a Yamaha or whatever. Um, that's absolutely not the case. Yamaha have a philosophy that wherever a product is made, and Yamaha make products worldwide, if it says Yamaha on the product, it has to be worthwhile. And it has to be of a quality that is worthy of having Yamaha on the piano, on the product. B1's no exception, made in our factory in Jakarta, but built to Yamaha's very, very highest standards. In fact, lots of the plant that's in the Yamaha factory in Jakarta actually originally came from the Yamaha plant in Hammamats. Um, so the quality is, is beyond question and beyond compare for uh, a little entry-level acoustic piano such as the B1. Just a brilliant little piano. The B1's signature really is that clean tone that you would expect from a Yamaha instrument. Maybe what you wouldn't expect from an instrument of this size is a really good, strong bass as well. So you've got the best of both worlds, a nice big thunderous bass and a little tinkly, very, very clean, um, precise treble. Makes playing this piano really fun, really rewarding, and it's an ideal starter to maybe progress on to a more premium piano later on, or indeed to give you a good foundation, you'll tend to find that the teachers love the Yamaha instruments because they are a little bit heavier than you would expect to find, uh, certainly on an entry level acoustic from other manufacturers. <laughs> And that's a great thing to have because it means that as a pupil, you are then prepared uh, to go and experience something like a, a grand 
when you take your exams for the first time or maybe for that first public performance where the piano is a nice big six foot or nine foot grand somewhere and rather than having a big scary moment where you leap onto the grand piano and find that it feels completely different to what you've ever been used to playing actually the B1 has put you in good stead for your future adventures. <laughs> The smaller size and the smaller sound profile of the B1 makes it ideal for a modern house or a apartment even. No matter what size of room it's going to go in, it will fill it. But it won't overawe a room and that's a really good thing. And the B1 will be contained and that's also helped by the laminated soundboard construction as well, which again just keeps all things in control, which is very handy to have. The middle pedal on B1 is a muffler control, which means that you can practice fairly quietly, fairly silently um, if you're concerned about neighbours or concerned about maybe um, waking up sleeping youngsters or whatever it may be. The acoustic uh, has this muffler operation. The middle pedal on the B1 silent actually completely stops the hammers hitting the strings. And at that point you can plug in headphones so you've got a combination of great acoustic feel but with also the benefit of digital technology as well so you've got an acoustic piano that at the flick of a pedal press it down latch the middle pedal then actually instantly becomes a digital piano with all the benefits of being able to practice silently <laughs> has two bigger brothers or sisters take your pick um, B1 B2 and B3 and they get gradually bigger which means of course that the tonal quality improves the tonal sound gets bigger um, B2 and B3 actually change feel on the keyboard a little bit as well um, as always it's always best to come in and see us in store if you can and um, we'll be delighted to show you these brilliant little pianos. Um, just a great start moving on from a digital or if you're a very lucky beginner that will give you just such a great introduction to the world of playing piano. Mm -hmm.